Monday Night Raw recap. And it's just me again. But we're just going to make it simple because, let's see, I'm doing it a little later because I was busy. But we got SmackDown tonight. But here we go. This is Monday Night Raw. Um, starts with Miss TV. Um, he's pretty much talking about money in the bank. Saying this Sunday you can catch it anywhere if you win it. Now he wants to talk about his opponent, Shane McMahon, at Money in the Bank. That it's going to be in a steel cage, so he can't run. Um, I, I think The Miz might actually win. I think he might. Who do you think, Shane or Miz? Um, and then he's bringing out his guest. And it's one of the wild card superstars. The big dog, Roman Reigns. Um, so he's coming out, and of course we're talking about Elias. And then, Roman said, if you need a wedding singer, then you can walk with Elias. Um, and then he's saying this Sunday he's, he's gonna bring the big fight. And he's saying about being buddies, and Roman's like, holy, 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 you're starting to act like the old miss. I came here to see the new Miz, the one who stood up to the authority and whatnot. And then they showed footage, and the Miz is like to everybody, so that's the Miz you want. That's the Miz you want. And then uh, Shane McMahon is talking, and then why Roman and Miz is standing in the ring, out behind comes Bobby Lashley and Elias attacking from behind, which makes the first match of the night Roman Reigns and the Miz with Bobby Lashley and Elias. And, of course, Roman Reigns and The Miz end up winning over a DQ. Um, Shane attacked Roman from the outside. Apron. And then all three of them just attacked The Miz. And then Roman. Um, they're all outside the ring. Then Roman comes in the ring. Then you see him. He's freaking high diving on all of them. And then, um... And then it's Shane and Roman in the ring, but... Numbers game, of course, and then Miz came in for the rescue with a chair, and then Superman punched the Lashley and the lies, and there's Shane McMahon running on the top ramp like a big baby. He is. Wow. So that's really simple. Let's see. And then there was an interview backstage with Braun Strowman. He's just pretty much talking about no one will stop him from winning the Money in the Bank, and then he got interrupted, saying Shane McMahon wants him in his office. And then you see Shane McMahon with Sami Zayn. And then Braun's like, oh, so this is why I got called to the principal's office, because of you. <laughs> and Sami Zayn is pretty much saying he wants to fight Braun Strowman. He wants to do the false count anywhere. He wants to throw him in the garbage like um, Braun did to him. And Shane made in a match saying for the Money in the Bank spot. I think it's bull when you tell him when I tell you who won. Um, and then next is Mo Raleigh finally back versus Apollo Cruz. It was a fast match. He pretty much did his. He won with his finisher on Apollo Cruz. Obviously, it's because he's he's back. And then you have Nikki Cross and Alex Bliss backstage. They're talking. Bliss is just saying about she doesn't want to be laughed at again like last week. And Nikki's like, yeah, you don't want to want that. And then she says, oh, Nikki, would you be in my spot? So now Nikki's added in the Fatal 4-Way tonight with uh, Natty, Naomi, and Dana Brooke. Because they're all in the woman's money in the bank. And then now it's double contract signing for Becky's two titles. Charlotte and Lacey. Um, it pretty much was talky talky, saying who's gonna win and all that. Really, you know how that ends up being. For some reason, I think Lacey Evans might take it. From all. I hope not. I hope Becky keeps it. But I think Becky's gonna keep it from Charlotte. I don't think Charlotte's gonna get it. I think so. But, here we go. And then. Becky ends up being a bra, and Becky's got them both, but of course, Lacey and Charlotte end up putting her through the table, and then they both hold the titles up, so you never know, Becky might win both, she might win them both, but we'll find out this Sunday, and then, then you have Baron Corbin versus Ricochet, ugh, 
Baron Corbin won. He pretty much won when it ends of days. I'm so sad. I can't. I just like Ricochet, not Baron Corbin. But, um, of course, he's bringing a ladder, climbing it up. Like, he's going to get ready, like he's going to get, and then Ricochet pushes him. So, we don't know who's going to win that money bank. Who do you think is going to win that money bank? I don't know. It's a lot. Might be Drew McIntyre. I think Drew McIntyre might win. We'll find out. And then, you got the woman's, um... A fatal four way match. Naomi versus Natalia versus Dana Brooke and now versus Nikki Cross. And um Nikki Cross actually won. She actually won. She um what did she do? She did like a neck yeah, neck breaker on Natalia for the win. And then all of a sudden you see Bliss coming at the end with her, helping her uh, Nikki put the ladder in the ring and Nikki's about to climb it. And then Bliss is like and then she's, she's climbing it, and then she sits on it with it like this, with the briefcase, thinking she's going to win. I mean, I don't know. It depends on who do you think is going to win the woman match out of the Raw and SmackDown. Let me know. Um, next match. Rey Mysterio, 6 of 9, versus Cesaro, Swiss. Yeah, Swiss. And then, well, Rey Mysterio wins. He, um, Cesaro tried to do the 619 in the match, but he got caught in the ropes. But, anyway, um, and then Ray got on top of the rope, but he got caught in the uppercut. And then neutralize, neutralizer, but it gets countered into a 619. And then Fox Flash for the win. There you go. And here's the creepy part. Firefly Funhouse. Okay, you say he's all hee hee happy happy. Now it will turn into creepy. Like he has Joker face paint on. Like, what is up with this Bray Wyatt Firefly thing? I don't even know. I don't even want to know. But that was that. Now the main event. I call Screw Braun Strowman again. That's what I call this. If you agree with me, put thumbs up. Braun Strowman for Zami Zayn, winner goes in the Money in the Bank match, in this false count anywhere match. Of course, it's going all over the place, everywhere, backstage, audience, everywhere, everywhere. And all of a sudden, Baron Corbin's coming out, he's helping him, he's helping Zami Zayn. Ugh! And then you got Drew McIntyre coming out, he's helping. And then, of course, um, Zami Zayn ends up winning, so he gets a spot. Braun Strowman gets so angry, because they're back by the announce table area, he gets so angry, he puts Sami Zayn through the, um... What the fuck? Announce table, duh. Um, but I feel like Drew McIntyre and Baron only did that so they can eliminate Braun Strowman, because that's, and Sami Zayn's an easy target. Like I said, I think, I think Drew McIntyre might win the Ma Money in the Bank. I think Drew McIntyre might. Who do you think's gonna win the men from Raw and SmackDown? Who do you think's gonna win the men? Let me know. Um, that's pretty much it for Monday Night Raw. I mean, let's see. Um, who do you think's gonna win this Sunday? Rey Mysterio? Is he gonna be um Samoa Joe? Or is Mojo going to retain it? Um, I don't know what the kickoff matches are. Um, do you think Lacey Evans is going to win? Or do you think Becky's going to retain it? Do you think Charlotte's going to win? Or Becky's going to retain it? Do you think AJ Styles is going to beat Seth Rollins? Or Seth Rollins going to be AJ Styles? I think Seth Rollins is going to be AJ Styles. Not only because I like him more. But <laughs> I like them both. But, um... Do you think is any Kofi in a match? I don't even know. Let me know. Um Let me know what you who you think's gonna win money in the bank. Who do you want to win in the money in bank? Let me know if you think Braun Strowman got screwed again. Obviously they will never give him that big title. Um and make sure you just like, 
comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Bye.